What is good hunters? In this video, I want to talk about animal behavior status and how it affects your hunt and you having a successful hunt. If you have noticed when you approach an animal or a herd of animals, uh, a sound bubble pops up and in the top right hand uh, of, the, of the window, you have a sound analysis that comes up. And the third row down, it says, where it says behavior, there's a status there. There's three statuses that animals have, and it's calm, it's altered, and it's spooked. Now, when it says calm, underneath that, it tells you the distance you are away from the herd or the animal. You want to keep that in mind as you stalk, because when it's calm, you can move closer to the animals. Now, when it switches to altered, in this altered state, the animal is a lot more alert. They know that you are there, and most of the times they're watching you. They're looking in your direction. You do not want to move. You're going to spook these animals. Don't matter what the distance is. As long as they're in this mode, this alert mode, they will spook if you move towards them. What you can do, you can move in a lateral form, left and right, keeping your distance. Do not move forward, move left and right, and sort of move around to kind of get eyes, if you don't have eyes on them, to get a visual. Now, what you will encounter, which frustrates a lot of players, and new players may not be aware of it, but they are probably frustrated with it also, is that you would be climbing up a hill and the animals or the herd will be on the other side of the of the mountain or the hill and you would spook these animals you see the problem i think is is that the game doesn't take into consideration you going up hills so that is not calculated because you would think being on the other side of a hill that you're kind of hidden that doesn't seem to exist in this game uh, hiding behind trees bushes does not exist. It's pure distance between you and how much noise you're making and the animal. So when you're going up a hill, same thing. If you if you were to approach that directly, you would spook the animal. So you want to move in a lateral left and right, move around the hill as quiet as you can, never moving forward. In that way, you can get eyes on the animal and you won't spook them. If you follow these little steps, you would find that you would spook animals less. And again, spooking is one of those things that it happens inevitably. You'd be walking around and you won't even notice an animal is there. You're going to spook. It is what it is. But to sort of have a better successful hunt, always pay attention to these, these statuses, the animal behavior. Be patient. Listen see what they're doing sometimes they're resting sometimes they're moving between zones they're moving to like a water source they're walking away from you they're walking towards you you have to analyze and see what the animals are doing so you can act accordingly i hope these few tips helped you will help you in your hunt thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next video